the Eastern Bypass expansion project starts at the 75 roundabout and much of the work has been done almost 70 to 80 percent most sections are already tarmacked and complete and are actually in use on the new lanes uh, construction is ongoing in some areas so you'll find some uh, barriers on the road and it's important uh, to take uh, uh, precautions when you're driving uh, through this section of the road at the moment uh, the risks are very very high between the 75 roundabout and the Ruiru bypass uh, so this uh, video is actually to sensitize motorists and drivers uh, who regularly use the eastern bypass road uh, to connect from Mombasa road uh, all the way to Thika road uh, using uh, this route so construction has been ongoing um, for the last uh, about eight ten months according to the transport cs mr james masharia these constructions uh, or this expansion was supposed to be complete by june uh, 2022 however we are at the end of the uh, of june uh, still uh, many sections are under construction uh, tarmac is still being laid in some sections we have a new roundabout that has been introduced at the Nairobi gate and this is a new feature on this uh, section of the road and it's very important for motorists to be aware about this because we have witnessed in the past uh, for those people who live in Utawala and uh, around and use this road uh, regularly the 75 roundabout had really experienced uh, many accidents where drivers uh, without uh, proper knowledge of this uh, area would uh, come speeding towards the roundabout and actually drive over the roundabout and crash their vehicles there so again the new addition of the uh, Nairobi gate roundabout will might be a challenge to new drivers uh, using this uh, section of the road and therefore it's important that people update themselves on the features that will be added uh, to this expansion works around uh, Amani area Benedicta area the turn off towards uh, Utawala shopping center has been uh, extended to almost where the shell round up, uh, shell petrol station is and vehicles coming from the town side or from the Nairobi uh, direction will be forced to divert into the U-turn as they enter towards Utawala shopping center near Shell petrol station so and those coming from Utawala shopping uh, center heading to Nairobi will continue driving the same way but those who will be heading towards the Thika road uh, direction will take the u-turn just opposite maguna supermarket like i've mentioned a lot of construction work uh, in some areas very intense we have two bridges that have been added to this section one is the roy overpass the roy bypass overpass has been added but currently still under construction Another bridge is uh, at a place called Kawash and that is after Roy Bypass as you head towards Sika Road and still uh, it's being constructed, not yet complete, uh, fully complete, so not open to motorists because uh, the tarmac is being laid uh, around that place. So these developments are still continuing to happen. Uh, probably the road might take another one month or two months to be fully complete after which markings will be done uh, a lot of work has been done also in terms of the divider uh, curbs and also uh, some areas like around shooters area aptc area that is admission police training area beautification work has started uh, so you'll see that uh, probably there will be flower beds uh, between the dividing uh, uh, section of the road 
so uh, basically this is just an update of the construction that is going on uh, along this section of the road and as a motorist as a road user uh, we suggest that you take precautions when you're using this road at night it could be very challenging because again situations are changing every day so where there was a barrier yesterday today you'll find the road has already been opened where the road was uh, opened you might find again it has been closed and blocks barrier blocks placed on the road so it is important uh, to be able to drive uh, cautiously along this uh, section of the road so enjoy watching uh, take note of the explanatory notes that have been provided uh, for you to be able to update yourself with the current situation this is as of the last week of june so within another few days a lot of developments will have taken place we shall where possible follow up with an update video on sections that may have had major developments we expect a uh, tarmacking of the Nairobi gate roundabout uh, either towards the end of this week or early next week and we shall bring an update on the progress on that so thank you so much uh, please if you are new to this channel I would request you to kindly uh, consider subscribing uh, liking the videos and also clicking the notification bell so that when I upload uh, new videos you will be notified of the new videos so continue watching I'll bring more updates on this uh, uh, construction and we also await uh, at the completion of this uh, road uh, which obviously will improve the lives of many people the transportation of goods uh, from uh, the central part of the country